So I'm the oldest of seven siblings, and it's four girls, and we have been very close since day one, but lately things haven't been the same. Being that I, I am a successful business owner, and they say that I'm bougie because I don't want to take my kids to L.A. to experience what I experienced growing up as a child. Being oh, you grew that, up in the hood? Yes, sir. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> being, that, yeah. being that I am a successful business owner, right. I'm not going to sit there being the fact that I grew up there, allowing my children to grow up there either. They say now I'm bougie. Oh, they want you to stay there? That too, yes, sir. Oh, okay. Well, you know, you got to understand, family, first of all, family is not like friends. Exactly. You actually pick your friends. You can't pick friends. Your family, you, you, you inherit them. <laughs> they just come with the package. And all of your family members, you love them, but you don't have to like them. Right. And I can tell you another thing. You can stop expecting all your family members to be happy for you. You can stop that right now. <laughs> Sad, but is it? Now, here you done, here you done pulled yourself up. Yes, sir, I have. Got yourself a successful business. Yes, you sir. moved. Yes, definitely. Because you wanted to give your kids a better, better life, life than the one you had. But I'm What's really wrong with that? <laughs> Absolutely nothing. But now, because you didn't have to leave somebody behind, now all of a sudden you bougie. Yes, sir. See, I didn't have that same thing. But then people are all like, oh, Steve, you get some money. As soon as you got some money, you moved out the hood. You damn right. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I love it. Best food I ever had was in the hood. Best friends I ever had was in the hood. Best church I ever went to was in the hood. Yeah. Best lessons in life I ever learned was in the hood. You better, the hood been good to me. Yeah. It made me who I am today. <laughs> Look, you want to sit around with your family for holidays, right? Yes, sir. Holidays about family. So let them, let them have whatever they want so your, so your kids can know them and know who they, they family. That I'm wrong for that and that I need to apologize. Should I stand my ground or do I apologize for not be, for not wanting to take my kids through the same thing that I went through? Since I'm bougie. No, no, you're not gonna have to apologize for that. Every, every parent that's worth being a parent wants their children to have a better life than the one they had. That's the rule. My kids, my kids didn't grow up like me. They don't, I didn't want them to. They don't need to know what I know. They can't, my... <laughs> my kids, listen to me. My kids cannot do what I did. They cannot. They, they're not gonna make it. My kids don't have enough in them to, to, to live where I live. I was in the hood. I was in Cleveland, Ohio. I was in the hood. For real. I fought all the time. I, my kids ain't never been in a fight. My kids, schools and little crest on their jackets. And... <laughs> you ain't got to apologize for nothing. You did the right thing. <laughs> Next up, hey, I'm Steve Harvey. You want more of that? Well, don't just sit there. Go get it. Press subscribe or click on this list and you can see all the amazing videos you want. Press it. Press it.